Welcome to our tutorial on Axios interceptors. First, we need to require the Axios package to make HTTP requests. We define max underscore retries as a constant to specify the maximum number of attempts we will make to retry a failed request. Here, we're adding an interceptor to handle responses. This function will trigger when a request fails. We extract the config from the error object. The config holds the request configuration and will be used to retry the request. We check if the config exists and if the retry option is set. If not, we simply reject the promise with the error, meaning we want to attempt a retry. We initialize a retry counter on the config object. This counter will keep track of how many times we've retried the request. Before attempting a retry, we check if we've already reached the maximum number of retries. If so, we give up and reject with the error. We increment the retry counter to mark that we're making another attempt. We calculate the delay for the retry using an exponential backoff formula. For each subsequent retry, the delay will increase exponentially. We return a new promise that resolves after waiting for the calculated delay. Once the delay is over, we make the Axios request again with the same config. We complete the interceptor function definition here. It will now handle any future failed requests. To use this interceptor, you simply make a request and pass retry. True in the request configuration. Now, if the request fails, the interceptor will automatically attempt retries with exponential backoff.